Hey guys, Matt here from Life Turnaround now. Well, this morning I woke up and I had really badly cricked my neck and my shoulder. Um, I, oh, I'm gonna lean over here. I actually should be wearing one of these. Uh, I have been all morning <laughs> like that, but I didn't really wanna wear it while I was doing this video, so I'll just have to get on. But um, I don't know how I did it. I mean, I, I get this problem quite a lot um, and I have to go and see someone and it, it just really plays on your mind. But you know what, I, this morning I was feeling really sorry for myself and um, last night my wife was rolling her eyes and she was being nice about it but she was like, oh, you're really feeling sorry for yourself. And this morning I was and then I woke up and I, after I woke up I was just like, hang on a second, I'm fine, you know, I've got a quick neck and shoulder and it's unusual for me to feel sorry for myself but I was and I suddenly, suddenly realised like, what am I doing, you know, there are people out there, um, you know, I'm fine, you know, this is fine, I can deal with this. Um, so my kind of thing to you is if you've got a small problem like this and you're feeling sorry for yourself, you know, get over it, quite frankly. Anyway, uh, that's not what this video is about. It is about this book, which is Ooh, The Field by Lynn McTaggart. Now, it's an amazing book. Um, if you've not read this, you, well, let me tell you what it's about. Basically, Lynn McTaggart is writing about the uh, zero point field. Now, the zero point field Easy way to explain it is basically something that connects all of us, okay? It's the energy that connects all of us in the world. And um, it, I, the way I like to think of it is a bit like, you know in the Matrix when Neo um, start, he can see everybody by numbers and people kind of rise up so they're part of that kind of field of numbers. That is exactly what the zero, or that field, that's exactly what the zero point field is about. And it's actually real, right? And the great thing is what, uh, for, for many years now, you've basically got the spiritual side over here saying, well, we're all connected, we're all one, there's an infinite intelligence, we're all, um, energy flows around us, all that kind of thing. And then you've got the science over here going, rubbish, 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 relativity, da 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 da, da. Then you had quantum physics, uh, physicists saying, no, actually, this is all real, there's dark energy, atoms come and go, um, there's lots of things that are unexplained, quantum physicists, you know, that kind of stuff. What Lynn McTaggart has done has brought in the field, which is a amazing book she has brought the two together and basically I can't remember which, which which way did I say anyway um, the point is she's brought the spiritual and the scientific or scientific spiritual together to basically show that um, we are all connected there isn't there is a there is an energy um, between us all and uh, you know and it taps into things like the law of attraction intention because really if you go down to the subatomic le le levels um, you know, atoms and things like that, they come and go. It's only really our intention which makes them stay and do something. Therefore, we are the creators of our current environment, right? Well, so it's big stuff, but the point is she brings it all together in this book. So it's just a great book to kind of, you know, I always struggle, I always, you know, if I'm talking to someone, I say, you know, we're all connected by energy, and they say, oh, we're very spiritual. I am, but I also like, I'm quite scientific too, I like that. I never really have the knowledge to back it up. I say, well, quantum physicists have proved blah, 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 but I never really understood how it went together. That's what she's done in this book. It's fantastic. I think, uh, so if you're watching this on my blog, there's probably a link somewhere to go to Amazon. If not, uh, if you're watching this on YouTube or whatever, just go to Amazon and have a look. Uh, but uh, I think she's also done another book called The Intention Experiment, which is also fantastic. I've not... Uh, read that one but it's supposed to be good too I've downloaded some of her audio and that kind of stuff um, so yeah I mean it's just a really really good book real understanding of quantum um, physics it sort of takes you through the story of things like remote viewing how all that happened um, healing how healing works um, and it's scientifically proven that this stuff works right so if you don't believe me or do believe me or want to believe me read this book um, great great book Okay, um, hey, you know, I'd love to hear your, your uh, views. Do a video response, do a normal response, whatever, and um, let's get a discussion going about it. You know, what do people think? Do you believe in this stuff? Do you think healing is rubbish? You know, do you think um, quantum physics is wrong? You know, what do you think? Anyway, guys, good talking to you. Um, that was The Field by Lynn McTaggart, and I will speak to you soon.